Union Longshoremen. Governess. I guess. And we're live! Playing Import Export, designed by Jordan Draper and from Dark Fight Games. Sorry for being late. We're always late. I'm not kidding. Um, so, do 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 do. There we go. Um, this is a game about shipping containers and the box is this adorable shipping container. It's really cute. Steve, it's, you can't really see the lines on the camera, but there's there's the lines that imply shadows, like the ridges of a shipping container. Um, Steve first was looking into this game, uh, and he was trying to sell me on it, and I was like, I don't really care. It looks like a shipping container. It's good enough for me. So, <laughs> <laughs> and then he told me the price, and I was like, okay, maybe maybe we should research it. Um, so it's designed by Jordan Draper, and it's from Dark Fight Games, and it is a card game. There's some money, and then there's these plastic ships. These are Kickstarter exclusive things. We are on Twitch tonight. Is it not on Twitch? Ugh, don't freak me out like that. I thought I linked on Twitch. Are we not? Are we not live on Twitch? Fun. No, we're live on Twitch. Okay. There we go. Okay. Um, yeah, nope. there's like a little bit of a delay, but it's cool. We're on Twitch. Um, so, um, Twitch ba -ba. might still say Bunny Kingdom. Hey, Eden. Bunch of, uh, Twitch shouldn't say Bunny Kingdom. It totally did it say, totally say Bunny, Bunny Kingdom. Kingdom. God. <sighs> might want to mute pretty quick, too. What? Why? Or mute the stream. Why mute the stream? Oh, you mute this? Yes. Okay. Mute the playback. Yeah. I don't know if we can edit this while we're live, but we can try. Let's give it a go. Yeah, it's weird that I can set it in the dashboard and, like, on the events, but then, like, it doesn't auto-do it. For this, yeah. For, like, we're, the cross. We're still figuring Twitch out, It's weird, because we updated it on the dashboard to say oh, import, did, export. Yeah, yeah, but on the thing, it still Maybe says money came in. Um, who knows? Who knows? Anyway, we're not playing Bunny Kingdom. We're playing Import-Export. You know what we're going to do? We're just going to shut the stream down and then fix it and then we'll be back. Sorry, everyone. Just one second. Just one second. Ah. And, we're and we're live again. We're back. Yeah. Um, apparently we're... on Twitch, you have to do it three times uh, to get it to update. And it's kind of funny because we were like, we're going to go to Twitch because it's better. Anyway, um, life happens. So, Import Export is a um, card-driven game where we are each we each own shipping companies, and um, we are transporting containers full of things to try and get money. The goal is to be the richest person at the end of the game. Just like real life. Yep. Yep. Um, we played a game recently where the goal was not to be the richest person, but like you made a lot of money, and I was very confused. The goal was to like have shipped the most goods, oh. but like. But you're toward money. I was just. I was like. I was like. This should be the goal. Like this. This feels better to me. Because we um, just played. Um, I was gonna name it. Oh no! We just played Iberian Rails, oh, and no. Iberian Rails. It was to get the most money, and our scores at the end were like. 2500 to 2400 or something oh, wow. yeah and then so any game you play after that you're like i need money like, yeah. it's like a money it's the whole hangover point. It's like, money yeah. um anyway so the point of this game is money and this is an interesting fact the money is twos and tens there's oh. no ones or anything so it's you need to remember these are twos and these are tens and huh. all the money that we're going to get during the game is divisible by two so you won't get anything less than two bucks no odd numbers um, also, at the end of the game, in addition to cold hard cash being points, you will get um, cash for any goods that you still you've like loaded on your ships, but they haven't shipped out yet. Um, oh, Ichi wants us to remind remember remind Steve that she is trapped. Um, the princess would like to be let out of her castle. Yeah. So that's um, you get, you get money for having shipments. Are, or containers loaded onto your ships even though they haven't shipped yet. Mm. And you also will get money at the end of the game for um, how many goods you've acquired in your... This is kind of the weird thing. You're, like, shipping stuff out, and you get... You collect the contracts, which will help you do stuff. But then you're, like, also buying things 
from the ships that have been shipped out to sea and you're like collecting them for I don't know what reason, um, thematically. <laughs> but um, for goods, uh, at the end of the game, for every like yellow type of good, you get a point. For every type of green type of good, you get a point. So on and so forth. Um, there's illegal goods in this game, which are worth two points. And then there are bonuses for whoever has the most of each type of good will get um, bonus points. Whoever has the most illegal goods gets negative six points, though. Um, so that is the primary way to get money, which is like the whole point of the game. Otherwise, this is a game similar to if you've ever played a Carl Chuck game, um, like Montanai or Glory Roan or um, Import X or Impulse, Impulse. or. There's another one. Um, the other one? Yeah, the innovation. One. Isn't that Inno innovation? innovation? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so it's very kind of similar to that. Um, it's also similar to like Race for the Galaxy if you've played that and you're familiar with the the whoever's turn it is will take an action, and then everyone else will have the option to follow that action. Mm -hmm. Hey, Gatesh, yeah. Gritesh. And then also before Eucronia. we jump into it, uh, oh, yeah. hey, thanks Patrick. to Dark Flight Games for providing this copy for us to stream. Oh yes, this stream is sponsored by Dark Flight Games for giving us this copy um, at Essen this year. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, yeah. It's been imported. It's yep. been imported. <laughs> we did um, import it. And this was on the other stream. I just love the box uh, that it looks like a shipping container. That was my big seller. Yeah. Um, for me. That's fantastic. Yeah. Um, okay, so actually I'm going to leave it on the table. Because there's enough room for this game because it's card driven. So what's going to happen is we're all going to get five cards to start. And the cards each have, they're each a type of um, good. Um, and then they also are a specific named good. And the specific named goods are pretty funny. They had a lot of fun making the named goods. I think every named good is unique. So there's some, there's some fun ones. Yeah. So this is like a satellite, chairs, a helicopter, yeah, yeah, yeah. and some drones. You don't have another card. Um, that's okay. So... We, each player gets five cards, and then we seed this main island with um, number of player cards. And then we put these containers out, these are our ships. We each technically own these ships, and then we have another one in our harbors. Um, but these ships we pre-seed with some goods, and those ones will each get four goods, and they're face up. Um, these boats, I will say, are Kickstarter edition boats. Boats, boats, boats. Um, so if you're playing with the not Kickstarter edition game, there's a card that is for, like, each player has two ship cards. And those cards are what you use. And the cards are helpful because they tell you how much money you get. But I like the little boats. So why would I not use the boats? Segways! Steve has segways on his boat. And there's shampoo. I hope the shampoo doesn't mix up with the segways. Oh, or the robot cats. And wine. And soy sauce. <laughs> and MRI <laughs> machines. <laughs> oh, and then there's some... Uh, oh, I have a Rolls Royce. Illegal minivans. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so... Um, each color, which does correspond to a player color, is a type of good. So we have luxury goods, which is Steve's color. Hence his fancy hat. Mm -hmm. um, then we have... Uh, I am agriculture, which is yellow. Normally, you're supposed to, like, randomize the player colors and deal them out, but we all play the same player colors so often, especially for streams, it's just easier um, if we just play our normal colors. And then John is technology, which is somewhat fitting. Um, <laughs> and then black is just, like, consumer goods, and red is uh, illegal goods. The best goods. Mm, as Steve says. Um, so those are the types of goods. This game is for two to six players, if you are curious. Um, there we go. Ah, Grant is Heather G. Rappert, so that is very smart. Hello, Doug and Andrew over in YouTube land. Um, it's a real country. It is a real country. All right, so what's going to happen is when it's your turn, you will play a card from your hand um, to say what kind of action you want to do. And the kind of actions are uh, contract, which is yellow, load, which is green, import, which is black, red, which is pirate, and supply, which is blue. And they do correspond to the technology thing. They're, they're all kind of linked. There's only five colors in this game, and they're used for everything. Player colors, action types, and uh, good types. So there's that. So 
when you select the action that you, when you want to do on your turn, um, everybody will have a chance to follow if they also would like to play a card of that type from their hand, or if they have an import of that color that they have added to their harbor. So let's talk about each type of action. So the first type is contracts. This is super, this is the primary way to get money. So when you have a ship in your harbor, like I do, it's pretty. Um, I can play a contract action by playing a yellow card. And then I would play a, I can play any yellow card. And then I would play a contract of any color for basically loading up that quantity of goods. So on the cards, at the very top it says, um, <clears throat> At the very top, doesn't really matter. But at the very top, it says like what kind of good it is. So this is rice. And then at the very bottom, it says how many containers. It needs two yellow containers for this contract to be completed. So um, if I wanted to do this contract, I would have to play another yellow card, which is of type contract. And then I would tuck this card, which is the contract I want to work on, under my ship. So this ship is doing this contract. The card that I use to do the action gets discarded. I don't have to play a yellow contract, that's just what I had in my hand that makes sense. Another thing to take into consideration is when you pick a contract, there are tiny little circles Sorry. over on the side, and there are three of them, and the number of circles filled in is how many tiers of that type of good you have to have already in your harbor which is a little weird. So the reason player colors match good types is that... You all right? <laughs> John's dying. Uh, <laughs> the reason that matters is because um, the more goods you collect, uh, the, more, the better contracts you can complete because the nicer contracts the thing is, when you complete a contract, you get the, the like thing under the named good. So after I complete the rice contract, I would get two credits for every agriculture shipment I have, including this one. But some, like uh, Some of those are like instant do it right away, and some of them are persistent for, yeah. the, for the rest of the game. But the nicer ones are like higher quality tiered, so you have to have delivered a, some of that stuff already to be able to get those. And that is one of the ways I cheated in our previous game. That is definitely a rule that is easy to forget in the, all the shuffle. Yeah. Um, each player starts with a tier one base of their player color. So I start with a tier one of agriculture. Steve starts with a tier one of luxury items, and John starts with a tier one of technology. And there are tier zero contracts, so you're not locked out of the other types. Yes. You're just slightly better at yours. There are zero to three tiers um, on each type of card. So there is that. Um, if you have yellow cards tucked over in your import section over here, they can boost your ability to do a contract. And what that means is that they allow you to play multiple contracts. You can have multiple contracts on a single ship as long as the desired quantity doesn't exceed six containers. Each ship can take max six containers, six cards, basically. Um, another thing that having them under here does is it lets you bypass tier rules. So because I have a base of one yellow tier, if I had a yellow contract under my imports, I would this have a base of two. I would have I could use this as a bonus action to have a base two tier of yellow. So I could do a two tier contract if I wanted. If I had another yellow over on my good side, this yellow would actually give me a permanent tier increase. Um, and so I could use this one. I would have tier three in this situation because I could have I would I've already gotten one good of yellow, so they like that. And then I have this contract bonus, which subtracts one tier of any color, because it's just a contract type. Oh. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. It's not because it's yellow. It's, it's just it's confusing because I'm yellow player. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, only the contract card does that. Yes. Okay. So that's the bonus for having a contract card under your imports, I is see. it it allows you to either do multiple contracts in one turn, yep. or <laughs> allow you to negate tier requirements for contracts you want to do. But not both. Not with a single card. Okay. Yeah. So that's doing contracts. This will make sense when we play. Um, then there's loads. So let's say that I had done the rice contract. Then I could do a load action. Load is a green card. So I play any green card. I discard it. 
Then I can load containers onto my ship. Um, this race contract requires two yellow cards, so I would want to load a yellow card onto the container. You get one load per load card you play. So I would say I'm going to do a load action, so I would get to load one card. And then if I had more load cards under my import section, I would get more loads. So I have this one here, I would get two loads, so I could load a second <clears throat> card if I wanted. And you can also play more loads to get more loads. You can also discard additional load cards if you want to load more cards um. onto ships. Okay. Um, then you have import. Import is you take, you start bidding, basically. So there's all these goods that are out at sea, not the supply island, but the ones on the boats. So whoever triggers the action, everybody else that wants to follow discards an import card to say, yes, I want to participate in the bidding. And then whoever is the leader, whoever's turn it is, says, we're going to bid on this boat. And then everybody secretly puts money in their fist, reveals, and whoever spends the most money will spend that money, and then they get two cards from the boat that was bid on. If you play multiple import actions by having imports under your harbor over here, or by playing multiple import cards, you can, you'll bid on multiple boats. Um, and when people follow you, they have to decide how much they're going to follow you when you first say. So you can't be like, I import, and then I import again, and then I import. You go, I'm going to import four times, right? So you would ha you have to declare that at the beginning, and then everybody else decides how many times they're going to follow you. Right. So, so there could be a situation where I'm bidding against both John and Steve, and then I'm just bidding against John, and then I'm bidding against nobody, and which means I get the cards for free. So... There's and those that. could be different boats each time, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, every import action, you pick which boat you want. So that's import. Um, when you do an import, when you pick up goods from a boat, the owner of the boat gets two credits from the bank. Yay! Because they delivered goods. And that's Ooh. interesting because it's the owner, not the winner. So. Yeah. Um, when you take the goods, let's say we all did that, and then I'm like, I want rope and Rolls Royces. Woohoo! Um, don't, yeah. Anyway, um, it's a party. I get these two cards. I can put one into my imports and one into my goods, or I can put both into my goods. You cannot put both into your imports, it's too broken. Um, so that is what you do with these cards when you get them, because you're basically buying them to ship or improve or show that you're really good at. At getting goods, I don't really know. That part is kind of weird from the we own shipping companies part. From the oh, like what the imports represent? Yeah, well, no, like from the theme standpoint, like we own these ships and we're like loading up contracts to get money. But why would we be buying the goods from yeah. other people? And they're at sea too, so like buying them at sea. Well, we're know. like having them come them, to us. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, think, it's a little weird. Well, I guess we're <laughs> exporting goods and then we're also importing goods and we're importing different things than we're exporting, like. I mean, maybe, but we're also, you could be potentially importing the thing that you're exporting. I mean, you could. It's a little weird. Okay, anyway. Um, that's the import You're on shell companies. And yeah, yeah, right. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, then we have uh, pirate, which is Steve's favorite action. It's the best action. So when you pirate, you get to take one container from a ship at sea or one container from Supply Island, and you get it to load it onto your contract. So basically you're like, oh wow, I really need another yellow card. I'm gonna go hold up this ship and steal this soy sauce <laughs> so I can load it up to complete this contract. So that's pirating. Um, when you pirate, the owner of the ship that you pirate doesn't have a penalty, nor do they gain anything. Um, There's insurance. Yeah, well, they don't get insurance money. Yeah. yeah. Uh, they just don't die. That's that's good. Yeah. They're all trained in, in pirate stuff, I guess. Um, if you want to pirate and you can't load a good, you just discard it. Because like Steve loves to do, you can hate pirate. Where you can be like, oh, Tiffany needs that good. I will pirate it, but I don't need it. I'll just throw it in the ocean. Right, and aren't you limited in the number of imports and goods you can have based on your shipments? Yes. So you could pirate something that you can't. Well, no, because you don't put pirate stuff here. You put oh, it oh. here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, load it under your contracted ships, right? Yep. Um, the last possible thing is supply. So supply, you sell a card from your hand to the supply island for four credits. Um, you can do this once per turn. So it doesn't matter how many supply actions you have. You can only sell once. Um, 
And then the other option that you can do is you can take a card from the supply item and put them into your imports. And that one you can do multiple times if you have multiple supply actions. So, however, there is a limit to how many goods you can have imported and how many goods you can have just in your goods area. So you have a maximum of one-to-one -one imports for shipments that you have completed. So you can't import agricultural stuff until you've shipped agricultural stuff, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. um, it's a one-to-one -one ratio. You start with a base <coughs> one for your good type. So I could load, a, I could have a contract import because I have the game basically is like, yes, you have a tier one yellow good. Um, oh, you can only have imports for the things you shipped? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yep. Um, and then for goods, you can have 2x the number of shipments you have as goods. So um, at the beginning of the game, we can have maximum two goods because we have one ghost shipment that is our, like, we're the player of that color. So, yeah, that is requirements. Um, when you, that's all the main actions. When you follow, you follow, you do your turn in turn order. Um, whoever follows goes in turn order from the person who's it. Um, you just discard the card like normal. You can use import actions to boost your following actions. If you don't want to follow or you can't follow, you can draw back up to five cards mm -hmm. in your hand. Um, alternatively, if it is your turn and you don't want to take an action, instead of taking an action, you can draw up to five cards, or if you have five cards, you can just draw the sixth card. Um, also, the imports and goods, uh -huh. it's just the number. It's not by color. So we can have, we can start with one import yeah. and two goods. But Well, because we have a ghost shipment. Yeah, we have a ghost shipment. But then when we add uh, more, it's not by color. So if I have one shipment, okay. I have my base yeah. of one plus one. That's easier. And then that means I can have two imports. And then when I have two shipments, I can have three imports. That makes more sense. That's so right. That's, I screwed yeah. that up. No, but yeah, fine. so at the beginning of the game, we can each have one import and we can have two goods until we complete Because we each have a ghost shipment right. that we've completed. Is there a limit to the number of shipments we can have? No. No. Okay. Number of shipments is not is not limited. Um, do do the important thing to remember is at the end of the game, you will get points from containers that you have in your harbor that have been loaded. You get two points per thing that's loaded. Um, any goods that you have in your goods area are worth points. Whoever did the best at certain things will get points. Um, the tiebreaker is you split the bonus. Oh, for that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Patrick it. asks if there's a wild flat, wild fall, wild a wild follow. follow like playing a pair in Glory uh, to Rome. Yeah. And there, there is, is there is a wild follow. You pay a you play a you play, you a, play pair. a pair. Yeah. The okay. designer said because I wonder if this is similar to Glory to Rome, but because you have a five card hand and there's five types, you always at least have a pair of one right. or one of each color. So you can so always you, do every. Action. You can always do yeah. As long as you have a full hand though. As long as you have a full hand, <laughs> yeah. you can always do every. Can we start with money. Uh, that's a great question. Hi, James. And you can play multiple cards. Five. We get it's an action. Um, you play one. I'll have to look that up. Oh. I might have screwed that up. Maybe you just play one card. And then if you have multiple imports, you can then do that action multiple times. Because if it's like Glory to Rome, Glory to Rome, you just play one card. And then if you have multiple imports, or multiple. Oh, you can also declare an action by playing two cards as a wild as well. So if it's your turn yeah. and you really want to import, so you, you can, can play two cards. You can wild action or wild follow. Yeah. Okay, cool. And you can't play additional cards from your hand to boost. That is imminent domain. Uh, okay. It's a different game. So it's only imports that let you boost. You can't yep. play more cards. Okay. Yep. I gave you two money, but I didn't give me money. <laughs> All right. We ready? So we start with 10. Whoever last ran a multinational import export company goes first. Oh, well, that's me. Um, but I mean, it wasn't under your name. It was no, multiple no, it was shell Polish, corporations. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so that doesn't count. But it, <laughs> but, but you said it was such like <laughs> that. <laughs> I think you have to go first. Yeah, like it was just. <laughs> it was so decisive. Uh, it was 
I was like, oh, okay, I guess James, I, I guess you know, John's going first. The old first. make a fortune, lose a fortune, stash it in That's the Caymans. Right. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Drug running, yeah. yeah. Yep. I think that works. Well, nothing goes under here. Oh, okay. well, you're, well, I mean, your no, your ship. That's yeah. why. Oh, your ship goes under. Yeah, ah, it's in the harbor. Because it's the harbor. It's the yeah, ocean. look at that. It's the place for everything and everything in this place. And this is Supply Island, and this is uh, your offshore account. It's Money oh, Island. Thank you, R. Smith. You do get. I, I, I did forget that. Um, you get one. You get ten credits if you have one of every good type at the end of the game. Oh, oh, that's bonus. what that line is. That's, yeah, that makes I sense think. now. Thanks. Yep. Drug Thanks running, bringing games back from SN counts. That would be me then, not John. Yeah. So I think you should go first. No. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I did do... I can, because I did that prep turn. That fake turn. Um, so I can do that. I will go first. I'm going to do a, a contract action. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's the one I'm discarding. And then I'm going to do the rice contract, which was the teaching example I was using. How about them apples? Do we follow oh, uh, first? Supply three? Island is number of players. That was the thing I was oh, we have about before. Three players, not four. What are you yeah. doing? I was just going to randomly shuffle. Okay. Do we all follow first, or do you take your full action and then... Um, you declare if you're going to follow, and then you and don't then... follow until I take my full action. Okay. Yep. So I, I will also follow. I think it just makes more sense if yep. I just do my full action, and then you have an option to follow. I am contracting as well. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 I'm making this bigger. I want to redo this um, overlay screen. Um, because I decided that I want to redo it. In the most hipster manner, I'm going to discard backpacks and glasses to say that, yes, I'm also contracting. Yep. All right. This might be crazy, but I'm going to try it. I'm going to make some massage tables. Yep. I think the reason you don't do your full action before people follow is because you can, you can do shenanigans for certain actions. You don't do your full action before people follow? I think so. No, you do do oh, your Oh, you do your full yeah. action? Oh, okay. But you... You can see if people are following first before you do your yes, collection. Yes, you can decide, yeah. but so you, you can decide what you want to do based on if you, people follow or not. But you take your full action yeah. before oh, people you do? follow. So we all yes. say, we're all going to follow, and then take the full action? Yes. Or, okay, yeah. So declare, and then other people declare if they're going to follow, and then the leader plays uh, one action of the declared type, plus an additional action for yeah. each type, that the import action, so all of them. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, you declare, sense. we declare for following, and, and then, then I take it. the yep. whole turn. There yep. we go. Okay. That's what I thought. What okay. is this Twitch thing? So then it's Twitch. I'm, I'm done. It's Twitch, Vince. It's Twitch. But yeah, I'm gonna change this. Uh, I'm gonna try and get the play area a little bigger, maybe the people a little bigger. I don't know. I've been watching Twitch streams, um, and people prioritize people over the game which annoys me yeah. um but i understand that that's a thing oh john you did a contract I sorry i make the massage tables well but it's I'm a little tense uh, and then wait well, and you're following yeah, oh, yeah, yeah i already followed so um i'm doing leather coats okay for the people who run the massage tables right. to wear yeah and then that's weird um okay <laughs> Uh, so then the discard is oh. secret knowledge but the top card is visible oh interesting i don't know why but it is there was a thing that said. There's probably, because every card has a unique power, so there's probably stuff that... Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's some cards that let you take cards from the Yeah, the, some of the secret powers are pretty... I think there's two or three that have very specific you win conditions. Um, there's a gambler card that's like... Or it's a gambling type card, which is if you have almost enough to win and you successfully, like, gamble and draw a card off the deck, it gives you enough to push you... Of course there's a card like that. Yeah. yeah. It's gonna... like you gamble 30, but it gives you 40 if you get it. So. I'm going to give up small poodles. To uh, do a supply action. Okay. Uh, oh, um, oh, okay. and it's Steve draw if you save. it's draw if you don't follow. Up right? to five, yeah. If you don't follow, yes. yes. If you Ooh. don't follow, you drop to five. That's, that's cool. That's the other critical rule. I am not following. Take a load. That's smart. Um, and then also numbers wise, the back of the player aids all show all the contracts. Half of each color, roughly, is a zero tier contract. Yeah. And then the other half have tiers. And then there's a rules companion that has every card in the base game and like all the powers they do. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah. Um, did you also draw? Sorry. Yes. Which makes I did draw. <clears throat> Common mistakes. Um, I'm going to pirate. Uh, I will also pirate. 
with flamethrowers. You I'm, use cannons. I'm, I use cannons. I'm using flamethrowers. Tiffany is very 21st century with her piracy. I'm gonna Most of the chat is there. in Twitch, James. Yeah. <laughs> We've been simultaneously streaming for the past year to Twitch and YouTube, but we've been prioritizing people in YouTube, but now we're prioritizing people so over on Twitch. So piracy happens, so, oh, what So do it's twitch.tv slash the one tire. How can I pass up these vintage wines? So um, I'm going to pirate vintage wines. I'm going to pirate soy sauce. Rolls Royce. <laughs> Which, yeah. All right. All right, that's me. That is you. I will um, pirate with drugs. Yeah. I'm using drugs to pirate. I have no cards. Um, I, I will drop to five. Sadly. You don't recognize the third player. It's John. He got a haircut. I got a haircut. Yeah. I look different. It's new. New John. It's new John. All right. I'm gonna get beer. I'm five pounds lighter. Uh, to complete this contract. Do, nice. do, do. Um, and you complete immediately? Well, so... Do, do, do. <laughs> do I complete immediately? I feel like there's a lot of marauding and not a lot of merchanting happening here. Yeah. But I mean, yep. just, just like real companies are basically just stealing from each other, robbing yep. each other blind. Yep, all right. So because I didn't do great things, it's not a lot. But um, this is complete because I completed this contract. So it's going to see. <laughs> and then um, we seed Supply Island. Whenever a shipment goes to seed, you put it, or goes to seed, you put it in Supply You put a card on Supply Island. And then um, if there are two to three containers on a shipment, you get six credits. So mm -hmm. I get... Six credits. Um, and now I have no boats. No boats, no boats. Um, and then this contract card, I actually get the contract card, and I put it under here, and it has a one-time bonus, which is I take two credits for every agricultural shipment I have, including this one. I only have one, so I get two credits. Nice. Yay! I'm just gonna put one of the one of the cards out. One of the player aid cards in a neutral color, so it's six, ten, and fourteen. Oh, nice. Yeah, Good these day. are what the ship cards look like. If you don't have it, the Kickstarter edition, they just look like the front of a ship. Or the captain's edition, which I think they still you can still get separately. I'm gonna import. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. So how many? I guess just one, right? You just play one card, yeah. Yeah. I don't have any import imports. And mm. I could follow for more if I really wanted to, right? What do you mean? Oh, I could, I could play like two imports no, to follow. No, you play oh. one. You, always... you have imports here. You can only ever oh, play oh, one. Oh, 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 right, right, right. Um, I will also. With follow. cups. With cups. <laughs> Scope and stuff. I'm gonna play wind turbines and flash drives to follow. So yep. I will follow as well. I'm uh, bidding on this one. MRI machines. Mm. MRI machines. Damn it, John. Out of all of the goods that you could be bidding on. There's no particular reason why I'd want that shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So it's secret bidding. So we put money in our hands. I regret getting changed now. If you fear change, leave it here. Bye, James. All right. All right. So I paid six bucks to get MRI machines. Yay! And I'm gonna put them in my. I just wanted my shit back. Um, <laughs> you actually do get two credits because I took a thing from your ship. Oh, but you get it from the bank. And you don't get it if for you the self yourself the owner, right? It's only if somebody else does. I believe so. Mm. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm also going to import. And we are bidding on yeah, my on my very you. sad. Wait, isn't your import just to? Bid yeah, it. you just were bidding, honey. That's all. That's you're... what I'm saying. We're bidding on this ship. No, no. no. You just got the opportunity. You to got bid. to oh. bid. You got to participate in the bidding. If you had two, then you could trigger a new uh, one. Okay. No, he right? couldn't have. On his turn, if he wanted to do an import action. But if you have multiple ones here. If you have multiple here, you do. It just gives you. Yeah. But you have to have bidding. multiple here. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. If he had one in his imports. Yeah. Then he could trigger another one. Very nice. Okay. Is money included? Money is included in the game, yes. 
plastic little cubes are included in the base game as well as the captain. Oh, interesting. Okay, and the leader always decides which ship. Yes. So even if you were doing the thing, John would pick which ship you would pull. From. <laughs> Tragic. Yep. All right, it's your turn. What you gonna do, Captain? Import. What a surprise! I'm gonna draw. Back of the card. Um. Five. Sure, I follow. All right. I don't want you to get anything for free. My ship. My, My ship. ship. My ship is on fire. That's not good. We don't need that. no Iceland water. Okay. Okay. What happens in a tie? Oh, I don't know. Steve took the rule book. In a tie, in a tie. The leader breaks ties. Well, there you go. All right. Let's import some things. I keep looking at these and I'm like, I really want that out of my hand. Can't get it out of my hand. Nope. Once nope. you see the card on the table, except you can never, never oh, get it back in your hand, right? Yeah. Correct. Correct. Um, but I do want. Let's see. Who doesn't want import cats? Um, and I want an extra import. All right, I'm gonna use big cats and stolen research to do an import action. Um, I will pass. Hey, Mer. Um, I will. Mer, I don't know if you've seen. We're starting to do more on Twitch, so if you're cool with Twitch, most of the chat's over on Twitch. I will follow. Okay. Uh, it's gonna be my ship. This ship. This beautiful ship. Yeah, it'll be that show. Okay. Two. I win. Oh, uh, but I, I obviously I keep my yeah. And I get these two, which gets me my ship back. Yay! Yay! Uh, I'm gonna put the beer under goods because that just makes sense. Uh, and then I'll put soy sauce under imports. Yeah, Mer says tie goes to the captain, which yep. I think is whoever's wearing the captain's hat. Nope, not how that works. I am going to contract. Bamboo. Hmm. Hmm. Mm, I can follow for free. That's true. Um, yeah. yeah, but before you do, I'm going to draw. I think Happy in the rules, if, if you do want to, you can pass around a captain card in case you ever forget, like, whose who's turn, turn it is. is. Yeah, so. we just passed the captain hat. Are you just doing one? Yes, uh, yeah, I'll be just doing one. <laughs> I could do two, I guess, but I'll just do one. No reason to. Mm. Well, I guess there is reason to. Can... I'll do two. So okay. I'll play potatoes. So two, two. That's right, you can fill up to... Oh, interesting. Okay. But you can only play one card to I know. do it. So I'm going to do two contracts on the ship. I'm going to do Jasmine Tea and Velvet Ropes. Patch. Wow, wow. Well. So um, you can do multiple contracts on a single ship as long as the quantity of containers they want does not exceed six, mm -hmm. which this will be six exact, which is awesome. Odd cards. I am done. Um, I... If you follow for free, you get to draw as well. Oh. Yeah, but I also yeah. I oh, decided to do a second one. So if you're, one, main act, yes. you're not playing a card from your hand, you get to draw, and then you get to follow. Yep. That's cool. That is cool. That is a good... Thing. It's very similar um, to Glory Run. Mm -hmm. These fixie bikes are saying I'm I'm importing. I will. Oh, this hand's the worst. Don't import. <laughs> this hand's the worst, but the names are so good. I want you to get that for free. So, yeah. I'll import. How's everybody's mm. week going so far? Which, which boat oh. are you doing? What boat are you doing? Steve. Oh, my boat. <laughs> I'm not doing your bok choy minivan rope boat. <laughs> um, There's so many Kickstarters that launched today. Who, is anybody backing Whoa. anything? Oh, John got it, which means Steve gets two from the bank. Yep. And I get my sheep back. Yep. 
It's very happy to have my sheep. Did you see the the? It's not gents, but it's the Gintas. Gintas. The Kickstarter. Yeah. That game looked interesting to me. Maggie really likes it. I know. And I'm always hit or miss on if Maggie and I agree <laughs> on stuff. Yeah. Oh, that was me. So it's hey, Mer. It's now he's in Twitch. I agree, Mer. The trick is to not get attached to cards in your hand because you yeah. need to constantly be cycling, yeah. which is the problem that I had in the first game. Is I got way too attached. Is it my turn? Yes. It's my turn. <clears throat> There's a white ship. Why is Should we use the white ship? ship or the black ship as or the what? captain ship? We don't need pass that. It around. We don't is need that. Is that confusing? Okay. We'll just need your hat. <gasps> okay. I call shenanigans. <laughs> Hatigans. Um. Uh, that's, the, that's the exact noise I make. I don't want any of these things. And I'm full up there. Mm -hmm. Which stinks. But I can get some goods, I guess. I will do two. Mm. AR says, I'm gonna pirate. Overlook getting import imports. You're gonna pirate, huh? I'm gonna pirate. Getting import imports is, is important. Yes. I'm gonna draw back to five. Okay, I am pirating this bok choy. <laughs> Nice. It's a tough. It's a tough world when you got a pirate bok choy. I'm loading. You loading? Load, 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 load. Load, load, load. load. I could load for free. Uh, so I'm gonna get my free load. I can't draw, obviously, but yeah. So go ahead. Okay. I will draw one card. Onions and fluffy pillows <laughs> for the massage table. <laughs> <laughs> table. Um, I'm gonna use these shower heads, which I will Scarlet put. Scarlet Pimpernel. I'm oh, gonna yeah. pour the vintage the wines in my. Which... Ooh. Yeah. We had bok choy for dinner last night. It's very fitting. Yeah, the vintage wines are being Mer sprayed through my shower oh, heads. Sorry, Mer. Do you think that we would like, uh, gents or whatever it is? I can't um, pronounce it. Gintas? Gintas? I guess. I don't know. And Scarlet Pimpernel? Oh, yeah, there was Scarlet Pimpernel. Did you look at that one? I haven't looked Eagle at Griffith? it. I've yeah. seen the art, but. Alright. I haven't looked at it either. The, uh, the new Nuno Centurino game is coming out soon on Kickstarter, too. Ooh. Brazil. Oh, wait, isn't Brazil a reprint? No, mm -hmm. it's, it's new. new is it a movie tie in? <laughs> Steve wishes. Yeah. I wish so yeah. bad. Uh, I'm contracting with these two loads. Yeah. Hi, Pepper. Someone is just very softly rubbing my knee with her nose, which is how I know it's Zena. Because Ichi would be like <laughs> with, her fa with her face. And Zena's just like, hi, I was wondering if I could have <clears throat> something. <laughs> or are you rubbing against John's knee? Or did you contract or you're falling? Uh, I can't do either, so All I don't right. do any. Hey, Jacob. I will draw. Jacob, just so you know, we are doing okay. most of the um, chat is on Twitch. You can hang out on YouTube if you want. That's cool. We'll talk to you still. But if you want to talk with other people. So I'm contracting these PlayStations. Uh, and then it is Tiff's turn. Uh -huh. We can't, we can use a marker or if we have a tiny adorable shark. Oh, we we'll just use Steve. All right, what about small Steve? Be the big better. Steve is cuter. Okay, we can small use Steve small. has a hammer. I need to make Steve's the hat. Okay, small small Steve. Hi. See now, this one's here demanding <laughs> things. Um. Hmm. Okay, I um. Ugh. I'm. So far, liking this three player, two player. It was two a huge a little, yeah. ping pong, which yeah. is is fine, but it meant if the other person didn't bid, you never bid. Makes sense. So it's it's strategic, but it doesn't have that like hilarious follow, right? Chain as much. Uh, I'm gonna supply. Ooh. So, uh, I'll do these two. I'll do fake DVDs and paper to do a supply action um and i'm gonna sell this um small tank to supply island for four credits and then that was my turn oh did anybody else want to do supply um, sorry sure 
I assumed for. I don't know. You've just you've tuned in for so many of our streams. I was wondering if you if you could infer. Cheers. Hmm. And I am going to redraw. Um, I'm just going to draw this. To... That's my turn. Oh, your whole turn is just drawing. Yep. We can't follow that. That makes me sad. I now know. it's Steve's turn. Makes me sad too. Well, this is tragic. Um. I am going to use I'm going to use these two imports as a load. Okay. Tiffany for a load. I get a, a load. free load, but I will draw and then maybe I will use my free load. Free loader. I will use my free load. Free loader. I'm a free loader. You won't. Oh, I will. Oh. I will be loading, but I'll for free. I'll be loading twice. Okay. Um, I'm loading these nanobots to power my PlayStation. Nice. Um, I'm loading Hawaiian salt to go with the bok choy. Very nice. Yeah, it's a good combo. I've got Ferraris and nice suits. Not crappy suits, mind you. Nice suits. Nice suits. Yeah. Um, I should also mention um, when you pirate, it can also be from Supply Island if people are interested. Oh, right. So if you really need about something, that. interesting. If you really need something for a contract, you, you can, can get sell it, it and then buy it. You can sell it then buy it. What? You could sell it to Supply Island with the supply action and then pirate it back later. Yep. Which yes. If, that's definitely modern twenty first century corporations. Yes. Speaking of, I'm pirating. Sell it and then steal it back. Hi, sweetie. You're being very cute and sweet today. Um. We don't have a lot of cards with effects yet. Oh. I'm the only one that's completed a contract. Wait a minute. You're going so. first. Yeah, I'm going first. Yeah, I'll draw. <laughs> uh, what did you do? You pirating? I'm pirating. I'm pirating. Okay, I'm going to take this helicopter yeah. and load it for my vel velvet ropes. <laughs> so the thing is, uh, so like drew. technically, yep. so I'm taking this satellite. I'm doing velvet ropes, and so technically, every container that I load that is blue is technically velvet ropes. And but we, it's more funny to just imagine that we're we're like helicopter brand or I don't even know. Yeah, it's just more funny that way. And you have to complete all the contracts on a ship before it sets sail, right? Yep. So yes. even though you technically completed the yellow. The, we're waiting on all we're my velvet ropes. Yeah. But my PlayStations is done. Uh, and I think it's a must when you it complete must, it. It's a must, yes. Because so I didn't put an initial contract on there. You did two contracts. So two first, cards. So first your boat goes doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, right. out to sea. And then you get six credits because there were two contracts. Yep. And then you put that under there. So now for every two technology goods I have, I may load one extra container with the load. That's very nice. Very nice. Uh, nice. So that was my piracy, which worked out very well for me. Um. So now it's John's turn. That's my turn. And... We fail at moving this. Ugh. Mortal Engines. It's the name of the smart card company. I have a terrible thing. Mortal image engines. I wonder if those are self-driving cars. I'm just gonna draw a card. A card? That's all I'm doing. For your that was your That, that was yeah, his turn. Yeah, he turn. he hates us. Again. No, my hand hates you. Mm. What do you have against them? Mm. Um I Oh. Oh right. Thank you. We we're supposed to seed oh. Supply Island oh, because whenever Steve's thing chipped. That could have changed it, but I didn't. Okay. Pants. <laughs> I forgot about that. There's now pants on supply earlier. Okay, so Murr's going to teach us how to publish it. If you trust the publisher, the G is pronounced the same as Gaffer. Gaffer. See, I so can't... Gaffer. 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 So Gaffer. Okay, so my turn was actually just drawing. So. I hate both of you. Hmm. Now my massage table mm -hmm. is could end up getting me one credit or three credits. What do you mean? I draw cards until I get two of the same type, then get credits equal to the number of cards drawn. Yep, but that's not that's when you play it. That's no, when but you there's no it. one credit. Wait, what? Draw credits until you get two of the same type. Take credits equal to the cards drawn. There's, it's probably... well, no, but you go until you get two. So you're going to always have at least... I guess you could get three. I draw odd, though. Mm -hmm. Probably round. Round up. Maybe, mm. To the nearest ten. Yeah. Sounds right. 
Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice, sneaky, sneaky there, John. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and do an import. Um, if I pass and I have five cards, I can still draw one card, or do... you can't. You the drawing plus one is only if you are the leader. Okay, so I'd have to follow. But I don't have any room for anything, so I pass. You importing? I'm gonna do ropes and minivans. Okay. Oh, well, you get it. But I get two credits from the bank! Yay. And I get my ship back. Nice. Thanks, Steve. I mean, hey. You're the best! These minivans and segways will help me do, do additional piracy. You get the ropes oh, I get too. Two it's cards. an import. Yeah, um, the ropes will just go. Into oh, cards. and I can have I can have this. That's pretty fantastic because I was an import, not yep. a piracy. Uh, I am loading. Loading, loading, loading. Anyone like to follow? I will not. I will draw. Um, I will also draw. Okay, I'm loading these two here, and so now I have completed this. So we seed one. Yep. Gold toilets! And there's... Cold toilets. And then that was six containers. No, EG. So I get 14 credits. Oh, hey, I have a free load action. Yeah! So I drew. Are you... You didn't follow. You drew? Did and you? you have a free load action. Are you going to use it? Well... I'm going to use my free load I action. I don't... I don't have any good... I don't have any contracts with which to do. And now I get to draw cards until I get two of the same type. I get credits equal to the cards drawn. Mm -hmm. And all all instants have that little. Do I circle in it. draw it publicly then? Yeah, I guess. So you see what I get? Wow. Do you keep the cards? Yeah. Oh, shiznit. Probably, really? probably not. So four. So it's problem solved. I got four. Massage tables. Uh, take credits equal to the cards drawn this way, rounded up to evens. But does he keep the cards? I get to keep the cards. That's the whole reason I played it. It just says draw cards, so. Yeah, I guess you keep the cards. Damn, that's good. Oh, it took me six credit or six containers. Yeah, because yeah, everything else is draw. So, um, you might have to discard down for hand limit. But... Oh, there's a hand limit. I don't think there's a hand Maybe limit. Maybe not. There's no hand limit. There's no hand limit. Okay, and now it's Steve's turn. Oh, you do. Do you draw one additional, even if you have greater than five? Oh, I think it's always one. No, you draw until they have five cards. Or one additional. Card. Oh, 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 oh! Or you can do yeah. the one additional. So, card. Also, so I could have drawn a card. Yeah, you could have. Sorry. It's okay. We're figuring it out. Um, I am doing. That's R. Smith. R. R. Smith helped us out. Doing a contract Thanks, action. There was the. There was some other Kickstarter. <laughs> Any player might buy chicken feed for six credits on ship. I'm not doing that for that, though. But that's my contract action, so. I will not contract. But you've got a free, though. I do have a free. So I will draw one card. And then I will probably do the free one. Okay. Uh, I am loading televisions into this shipment. Cool. Uh, or when it's done, I may load my technology containers onto any shipment. Ooh. I'm going to do tablets. This contract. And it's a text zero, so I can do it. Alright, All right. Uh, my turn. Oh, that was with your free. Yeah, I got free stuff, yo. Free stuff. <sighs> Darn it. Darn Love it. that free stuff. Darn it. Um, I want to do things, but they don't make sense to do. I want to pirate John's luxury boat. <laughs> It's the best boat Please out do. there! Take all those goods. I will draw a card. I'm gonna... No, Arsmith, we're super happy you're doing it. Yeah, no. Thank you for no, correcting. It's, it's yeah, awesome. no, it's it's yeah, tough. It's really good. We played this. We we haven't played this in a while, and I was rereading the rules before the stream starts, but I'm also like fighting a sinus infection or pneumonia or something, so 
Yeah, and, it's helpful. And like you said, there are definitely things that are easy to miss that can make a huge difference when yeah. stacked up, like not drawing over five. What you doing? Uh, supply with my Teslas. Um, I will draw. I'm gonna start shuffling up. Yeah, there you go. There you go. I took a pirate. Oh, gay men. We never talked about that. The gay oh. men's when somebody <laughs> has fifty credits, like on their thing. And you actually. You talk to the card under your imports that if it were a contract, was the game end changes to seventy credits. So there's lots of powers which like change yeah. the game yeah. end and stuff. There are several fun. cards that um, will be like you win if this happens. Um, there's also um, there are also if there's no cards in the draw deck or the discard because we have them all tucked everywhere or like on ships and stuff. That's when the game ends up either. Yeah, I'm just gonna even though that hasn't been drawn. Yep. I'm gonna, that's fine. Right, Kairos. It's me? Yeah, it's you. Um, I think I'm loading. Loading, loading, loading. Is Phil, started, did, loading. It's Patrick. I keep calling him Phil, but his name is Patrick. Did you leave Patrick? Oh. Oh. It's your turn. What are you doing? I did. I you loaded. load. Yeah. You load in? You load in. You load, 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 load in. Wait, uh, no, sorry, I'm importing an idiot. Okay. okay. I liked loading better. Yeah, I, like loading I did too. I thought you could load from ships at sea, <clears> which <throat> makes no sense. Okay, well... Also, this is free candy in this container. In that in that container? Yeah, yeah it's free candy. Okay. Good to know. It's legit. Um... <sighs> Um, I guess I'll draw a card. I'll follow. All right. What ship? What ship? What ship? What ship? What ship? Not John's ship. I, I assumed. No. Oh, interesting. You can't. That's you can't one to one, so it. these have yeah. to both go to goods. You now have tier three technology. Burp, burp, burp. And tier one of the. Okay, well. And then I can load one extra container with load now because it's for every two mm -hmm. technology goods I have. All right, that was my turn. That yeah. was an okay turn. <laughs> You're cute. Your turns are cute. Um. Okay. Wow. Here, have a Steve. Yeah, I love having Steve. Um, I'm gonna load with telescopes. I'll draw and follow. Um, I will also draw and follow. So okay. I draw. I'm gonna load. Then... Oh, Hang you on, first. you jerks! <laughs> I get two loads because I played a load, and then I also have a free load. So I'm gonna do two Ooh. luxuries, Ooh. so I complete my big fancy boat. Wow! Toot, toot. So we see it's Supply Island. With one? Yep. Uh, yep. Your boat needs to go back, sir. Oh. Sir. Get your boat out of here. Um, and then... I have Velvet Ropes and Jasmine Tea. Very nice. Now, so all the cards in my hand are worth one credit at the end of the game. And then when I contract, I may also sell one card to the Supply Island for two credits. Nice. Um, so that's... Yeah, we're now finally getting some contracts sold. Yeah. Uh, I'm loading here, which will complete this one. Um, I guess I'll go there. Now I should say one thing they did recommend in the player guide is um, try to always be working on one ship and then have another one out. Where if both of your ships are out, yeah. your options will be constrained. I, know. I think John's about to experience that. I was about yep. to mention it right when you completed your contract. I didn't. Um, I'm just using my freeload. I'm loading. Such a freeloader. Yeah. I get to uh, or refrigerators. Yellow cards are wild. What? I'm gonna import. Surprise, surprise. Surprise. Guess what ship? No. <laughs> but yellow cards are wild. Oh, your yellow cards are yeah. for him. Yeah. Mm. Sorry, you're playing an import action. Sorry. He's doing an import action. I do not want to follow. Hey, Kabuki. Steve, Do you don't are follow. you following? You. Yeah. You can't put anything in your work. I can hate follow. You could hate follow. Oh, I'll I could just, hate follow I'll too. Just draw one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. I'm getting a little 
this to me. Don't forget your... Oh, yeah. Con- credits for the six container ship. Oh. Yeah, that would be the whole point of that. And I get 14 credits. I shipped a two container ship. I get six. You get six. Yep. Oh, when you did this one, did you get your... I did. You did. Okay. So I got those ten. See, this is why you're around, Arsmith. <laughs> this is... I'm going to get another ten. We need reminders. Um, I'm pirating. I'm at 30, by the way. I'm at almost 30. I'm at four. <laughs> Steve's pirating. See, pirating isn't isn't a good life. You shouldn't do it. Um, <laughs> uh, do I want to pirate? What's up here? I don't want to pirate. Did we seat this? Yeah, I, for me. I Did we seat it for John? Uh, no, just no. for you. I don't want to pirate. Uh, I'm gonna pass as well. Yeah, I will draw. I, I have nothing to pirate. Okay. Steve's a pirate I'm on a Segway. Pirating these gold toilets. He is a pirate on a Segway. Alright. He stole a bunch of gold toilets from Beyonce, probably. How did you guys get so much money? We completed contracts. Yeah, but so what you gotta tell do. me more. <laughs> tell me tell me how this works, he says. Um, I would like to import. Import, 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 dent. You're importing? I'm importing. Um, yeah. Mm. Mm. I'll import from my own ship. Contract and supply. Agriculture. Hot. Well, I get two credits for you doing that. Yep. Um, I'm gonna take um. Take two luxury. Yep. Darn it. Darn it. Darn it. Darn it. And that's we get uh, one credit per good and then six if we have the most? Uh, yeah, except for luxury goods, which John now has the most. I'm going to uh, contract. Um, follow. Mm, yeah. I will follow for free after I draw. Here. Making shotguns, y'all. What you doing? Uh, Pika. Uh, I'm gonna do honey. What? It's what I'm gonna. It's what I'm gonna contact. Bish. Um, I'm gonna loot. I will follow for free. Okay. I will draw first. Alright. Um, free load plus the regular load. I'm loading two containers onto this paprika shipment. Which completes. Uh, and then my Paprika goes up here. When contracting a new shipment, I may also load one container. Uh, uh, and then I completed right, so we seed Supply Island. All right, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna load these smart cars onto this tablet order. Oh, and I get it. six credits. Um, I forgot I could draw and load, right? You have one load, yeah. You can. Okay. You can instead of playing a card, you can draw a card, yeah, and then you get your free load. Is that it? I have wheat. Yeah, that's right. Um, pirate. I will draw and follow. Um, and then I will try a brand new hand, hopefully giving me what I need. Uh, 
I'm gonna pirate this Hawaiian salt from my other thing for this contract. I'm gonna pirate this small tank. <laughs> Completing, yeah. completing yeah. my shotguns. There you go. I'm, I'm assuming this takes effect immediately. Yeah. Uh, so, and Steve, then hold I on. will. So, oh. if you want to pirate, you have to pay me two credits or two cards. Mm-hmm. He now has shotguns. He also gets six credits. He gets six credits. Is that when. Uh, Any players who pirate before you. Oh, before? Before you. So, it's it doesn't it ha- matter now because it was after. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, but I am going to pirate using my free pirate, um, and I'm going to take... That's weird. Oh, I can't pirate anyway, because I can't load on one of my contracted chips. Okay. Why not? Because there's no green or blue out. There's, oh, there is! There's a ton of blue! There's That's what green. I need! Okay, well then let's do diamond rings, and then... Oh, I don't have, I don't have another green card. Silly me. Okay. Mm-hmm. All I need is a green card. Um, that was you, John. No, that was that was me. Oh, that was to me. I'm importing. I want to import, but I can't. I also import. <laughs> Which ship? Um. Yeah. For some reason in my head I have that this is the last stream before Space UA, but it's not. We have one more. Did I seed? Oh, did I, I seed have. when I completed well, that contract? Well, I think the, with the free one, I don't think you did. Yeah, because I, I can take eight. I think so. You can take eight, yeah. Yeah, so I'm at seven right now. That's the weird thing is they're like two X, but yeah. it's did it's... we seed when you completed that contract? I don't think we didn't seed when I did. I don't think we seeded when you did. When I just shipped, just shipped the two. Did we seed supply? The small island? tank and the. Oh, did I? I don't think I don't we think did because backpacks either. was the one on top. Didn't I give you six credits? I gave you six credits. Did six credits? Okay. Yeah. Oh, and you just used them. You just bid. I just yeah. used them. That's right. Okay. Supply Island has a lot of imports. It's Piracy does. and big cows. Okay. Great. It's Kyra's is fine. Um, my kingdom for a green. Just saying, um, don't forget your credits for six container shipment. Oh, that was who was that? That was me. That was a while ago. That was a while ago, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna import. You're gonna import. Mm, could it be piracy instead? <laughs> uh, I do not want to import. I could, just to prevent you. I guess I will. Thank you. <laughs> uh, it is this ship that we are bidding on. Apples and coffee. Ooh. You win it. Alright. I like how this pistol container says onions. It's important. Uh, I'm going to do two credits, or sorry, two pirates to do a supply. Um... I'm gonna do like do I want imports or do I want or sorry do I want imports or do I want piracy? Hey Kabuki. I feel like imports have been a rolling. Piracy is so good for contracts. I'll take piracy. Uh, we didn't have a chance to follow. I That's mean, true. I took long enough to debate, y'all. Yeah, supply. Yes. You drawing? Yeah, I'm drawing. Uh, I can't have a yep. Okay. I am going to contract. Speaking of 
Steve, do you want to draw? He's contracting. I will do both of these here. Oh, soap and flash drives. As you do. Delicious. Delicious. Um, I am also going to contract. But you drew. Oh, you're doing a three one. Yeah. yeah. I guess I could put another contract on this ship. Because I have... Oh, do I only have Tier 1 in Agriculture? Yes. Yeah, Tier 1 Technology, Tier 0 Soap. Okay. Thanks. Um, Could you play... Oh, no, that's a... Sorry. That's a good... Nice job trying to catch me. <laughs> Rules Warrior. Everyone loves those. They're helpful to an extent. How they present it yeah. determines if they're loved or not. It's true. Debate in his contract. It certainly is. Mm -hmm. I won't do my stupid free contract. I'm realizing maybe I should oh. do a free contract. That was me. That so. was you, so Tip gets a pawn. Mm, yeah, I'll do chapstick. Sorry, chapstick. Nice. All right, now Steve's the Steve. Yeah, so Steve Steve. I'm going to load, and I'm just going to load. Oh, oops. Do your worst. I will follow. I will draw and follow. Yeah, the tragedy is I didn't have the tech level to... Because um, we only get tech level from goods, not from shipments, right? You have a super high tech level. Yeah, I didn't have anything. I couldn't. You do have any the tier of... level for something else. Yeah, you have I didn't. Very... Okay. Yeah, I didn't have the tier level to do anything in your hand. Anything in my hand. Okay. Um. But yeah. So I'm I am to... loading cell phones, completing this contract. Yeah. Finally, I get fourteen bucks. Yes. Yep. And we see. And it was two contracts, but it's just one ship. It's only, it's you seed per ship, right? No, per contract. Yeah, per ship. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff that's out there now. Okay, so. Okay. I'm loading chicken feed for... and generators. Nice. I loaded bubblegum for my soap. Whoa. <laughs> my luxury goods are now worth three credits each. Ooh. Good thing I don't have any. Um, and I may load tech containers onto any shipment. Nice. Sweet. Uh, I'm gonna do import. Import, import, mm. import. That is an important thing. I will thing. pass, I think, because I can't fit anything else. Well, could get one luxury good. That's not bad. Sure, I'll follow. With my two. You following? Carry this Eat on. that paper. Pick cups. Get some more of these. Oh, which ship? It's a great question. No. I should get this guy back eventually. Do that one, I guess. P yeah, people have mostly been importing from their own ships, right? I think. Yeah. Because I don't yeah, think we've had a chance part. to miss the two credits per. Which hand, Tiffany? Oh. Um, Which hand? Um, this one. Ooh, five. Nice. Alright, um, I'm gonna take... You, you seeded for... Or did someone seed for me when I completed yes. the ship? Okay, good. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna say the door, yes. do yeah. these two blues. So I now have a supply. Nice. You get the blues. And I now I also have a tier one luxury. So there. Um, I'm gonna pirate. Uh, I will draw and then potentially follow. Uh, we might run out of cards. See, yeah, I don't have any contracts. Now, so I can't. Amen. Cool. Really? 
Yeah. It's after the first reshuffle event? No, like out of cards. Like, like there's no, no longer draw. Oh, oh, when there are no cards left. Yeah. So that was that was one of the other endgame conditions. Uh, Steve, you want to follow? Uh, nope. I'm just drawing because I have no I draw cards, and then I'll follow so. for free. Okay. I'm going to pirate three times. So I'll Hello, take... Hello, little one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, two. Oh, so last night, really late <laughs> night. <laughs> How many do you need for your yellow? Some of these I'm powers... Yellow. Yellow. Okay. Some of these powers are so black. amazing. So I finished um, both of these. So this is going to ship. Yep, so four containers, you get ten credits. Um, ten, ten. And are you following for free? No. Okay. Because I have no contract. I, I will pirate um, this mouthwash. <laughs> Sorry, I just really wanted now, to pirate Now, does this happen immediately ten. before it ships? You may take one loaded container from completed shipments into your hand. Uh, if it doesn't have the little eye symbol, that means it's, it's not when... instant. It's, it's when you instant. trigger. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, that's not. It hasn't. That was your turn. It wouldn't trigger on itself. Carries his turn. Um, I'm going to contract, and this actually contract gives me a free. Sorry, this gives me either a free tech level or another contract action, right? The imported contract. Oh, it I lets you reduce a uh, tier level. A tier level, nice. right? Yeah. Um, I can't. But I, I can't like boost Why from my hand. Down? Yeah, because it was a discard pile. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. I will draw. Yeah. Okay. So I can only get a plus one tech level if I want. Tier, not tech. Tech tier. Sorry. Yeah, I know um, you're the tech. Oh, you're not even the tech company. Drugs, baby. Nice. Because I have a bonus. Steve's running drugs. Oh. From that. oh, but did you all what decide you wanted to follow? Say? Sorry. What would your mother say? I we drew. You yes, drew. we okay. decided. And um, uh, when contracting a new shipment, I load a container, so I'm loading poison bottles into my drugs shipment. Nice. It's great. You're really you're on top of your game. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a dog. It was just a fuzzy ball down here. Yeah, like, wait, there's there's, a, that's there's a, a dog. There's a fuzzy ball. And that's under a the dog. Table. Um, I think I want to do in. Uh, this is definitely starting to make sense to me now. Yeah. Now. <laughs> At this very moment. This moment. I had a hard time getting moment. into the flow of it in two player. Uh, right, I'm gonna do import. Game. Great. Uh, we're doing this ship. Sweet. Ooh, it's been there. Oh, who gets? Uh, I get it because I'm the captain. But I get a buck. I get he gets bucks. two bucks from the from bank. The oh, because it was. You still pay your money. Oh yeah, that's important. <laughs> Not used to winning. That's how <laughs> Tiffany has so much money. No, I'm just kidding. What? Just kidding. Uh, I wouldn't uh, insinuate that you were cheating. I'm also importing. Uh -huh. I'm gonna get that shit yeah. back early. I'm just gonna draw. Boop. Some change and go more broke. No, I won't. I won't import it. You can just have it. Oh, sweet. Thank you. Oh, mistake, that is a uh, mistake. Yep. Yeah. Because, yeah, I couldn't because. Uh, oh, which means I followed. Sorry. You got. Who has consumer? You got one consumer and you got one consumer? Yeah. One consumer. And I'll do another load. John's going to win. Really? Have you seen his money pile? It's kind of like goods. You're importing two? Uh, I mean, yeah, you can only import two goods. I'm importing two. You're importing as well? Yes. I'm importing two as well. Thank you. You should make John do these things. I don't have the card to do it. Can you guess which ship? How many luxury goods do you have, Steve? Zero? Zero. Okay. That's unfortunate. <laughs> yep. 
That's fine. So now we have to I'm at 40. All right. Game is at 50, right? Go yeah. Ahead. Um Incidentally, I'm going to pirate. Um I have no thing to pirate. Um, I'm just gonna draw and then free pirate. Okay, so I can pirate twice. So I will pirate this pants. Put that there. Uh, and then Steve really wanted the big cats, no! so I'll pirate them and then throw them in the ocean. <laughs> no. Um, and then that completed this contract. Boop, boop, boop. So, these beautiful goods are now available on the high seas, but I get two credits, or sorry, I get 16 credits because that was the contract. Ichi, Zena. Why do you get 16? Because it was a, it was a full ship. Of... It's 14 for a full ship. No, it's 16. It's 14. It's 14. You're right. Okay. Um, then I now may, I may now ship eight containers per ship for 18 credits. Also, I get two credits for every agriculture goods players has. So John gives me eight, so I get another ten credits. Thank nice. you. Um, and then I take two credits whenever a consumer good is gained by me. I'm assuming. Oh. What? Can I? Um, for tablets. This says. Can I do that before I pirate? Yeah, I guess. Whenever a consumer good is added to any player's goods, take two credits. Okay, so because so it doesn't specifically say I did do. draw. Chapstick? Whenever yeah. anybody yeah. gains goods. Nice. I did draw. I'm pirating as well. What is your or, main action? This is your, your... No, I'm, I'm Oh, following you're following you. my pirate. But first um, we have to see pay me two credits or two Supply cards. Island. Because you pirated before me. Have some jets. Thank you. And some fixie bikes. Awesome. I love fixie bikes. No, I don't. They're terrible. Um, and then I get a pirate twice, which I'm gonna take these two, which then ships this. Mm -hmm. Which gets me six credits. Put that there. And then my action's gonna be. Well, wait, Steve gets to pirate. Oh, sorry. For my turn? And this is part of the supply. Over here. For your turn, my turn pirating. I think John's gonna end the game. By the way, it says you may load your technology containers onto any shipment, but that's load. Yes. Yeah, I can't follow. Okay, so right. now it's John's turn. Su supplying to sell a card. Yep. For four bucks, which gets me to fifty. Boom! I can supply for free and sell. Uh, awesome. Hold good. on, you skipped me. Oh, do you want to supply? Current turn finishes playing out. Do you want to draw or supply? I gotta draw and a free supply. Probably just gonna do supply. Okay. I get to draw. Okay. And then. And then I did my free supply. I'm gonna sell the mother load to Supply Island for four credits because that's the best I can do. All right. Two pets. Do we finish the? <laughs> we just finished the current turn, not the round. Yes. Okay, so the John triggered the end game. So now... So our hands are garbage. garbage. Well, there's, there's a card that lets you get money for... Oh. Yes, mine. Yeah. My card. <laughs> um, okay, so first things first. Um, you get two credits for every good still in your harbor, like on a ship. So oh, Steve, you're yes. going to get two credits. There you go. Um, ba ba ba. Every good over here in your base area is worth one point, except for illegal goods are worth two points. So I get four. So these are three each, so I get six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Why are they three round, each? Round it up, maybe. Hmm? Why do you get three each? Because of my leather coats. Okay. Um, does, does it mention... It does not say. I think I would assume they just round up. Yeah. Okay. Because the other card that consistent. John had was round up. So. Okay, and then I get one credit for every card left in my hand, which is another four credits, because I have that card. Yeah. 
There might be something else about rounding, but I think that's fine. Um, and then majorities. So whoever has the most agricultural, that's John, gets six credits. Whoever has the most tech, that's Steve, gets six credits. Whoever has the most consumer, that's John, gets six credits. Most illegal gets no negative, and no yeah. one has that. And then, oh, interesting, though. If you get illegal, yeah. it gets you yeah. 10, so it's a net. Um, and then, Well, if you have the most, yeah. Mm. And then no, no, most just, luxury. If you, have, if you have one, yeah. yeah. Most luxury, I think, is your tides. So yeah. You both get eight credits. And then if anybody has one of each good, which no one does, they would get 10 credits. My score is small. Not as small as mine. <laughs> and then we record it. Yep. Uh, my score, even though it was not a winning score, was the meaning of life. 42? Yep. Nice. Oh, yeah, I beat him. I had 78. <laughs> yeah, John, John But if you nice. combine our scores together, we, we beat John. We beat John. <laughs> um, I was 44. So let's import export. Nice. Um, it is. It's very glory to Rome esque. It really is. Have um, you both played glory to Rome? Not in a no, very very long I've time. I played Mott and I have played glory to Rome. They're they're quite different. Seventy eight. Okay. Uh, Seventy eight. Um, yeah, just mechanically, it, I've heard there's a lot of similarities to glory to Rome. I'm sure feel yeah. of the game is very different. The difference with Matina and glory to Rome in this is that with Matina you can get your cards played immediately. With this, you have to like build up to it. And same yeah. with Rome. And I like that a lot better, that delayed building towards something. Yeah, I really like that in this. Well, it, yeah. Partly it's just fun just to be like, okay, this is in my hand. Yep. It's going to be a long time before it gets onto a contract exactly. and it's completed. And yeah. I get the effect. Like, I really like that. The first game we played, Steve and I both got way too attached to the stuff in our hands. Mm. So, like, I was trying to do a mother load. If you have eight illegal goods, you win immediately. But because it's a tech three illegal, <laughs> oh, John three wins. Illegal. Yeah, John. Wins. Yeah, and you'd have to have like a lot of contracts completed to do it. Yep. Yeah. Um, I really like. I like the auction stuff a lot more, just because in two player, I like that. in two player, or I liked it more in three player than two. Because yeah. in two player, it was like, yeah. if the other person didn't have either a free import or money or whatever, you just you get just it. get it for free. Yeah, that's which is um, rough. So it's easier, I think, for two people to police one. Yep. Well, and that's um, I think if, this game was up to six players, which I think would be over way faster because of how many cards right. like yeah. we were running through. But um, um, yeah, the bidding, the auction thing is is this game plays two player. I don't think the bidding works super well two player for the reasons yeah. Steve was saying. I think the rest the rest of the game is fun, but mm -hmm. you're just missing I think some of the yeah some of the multi the, like Shuffle. bidding work. Um, so yeah, I played I think two rounds of this, just two rounds at Essen, which is what made me interested enough to um, to like want to get it and do it and everything. And that had a nice like it was still I was still trying to grok it because that's also when it was taught. But um, excuse me, I liked kind of the just sort of the hilarity and wackiness at six player. Yeah. Um, and they mentioned they really the designers actually really enjoy it two player. Hmm. So. I can see it being slightly more strategic two player. Yeah. Yeah. But um, I I liked how there were more. Shipments. Yeah, I liked that there were more shipments. More I liked that there was more following happening. I liked that bidding was more interesting. <coughs> I definitely enjoyed this better, three player than two player. Um, if you get the captain's edition, it comes with like a ton of expansions. We're well, not expansions, but yeah. I, yeah, I, I think they're, they're all like, they're all expansions. expansions. Yeah, there's like four or five. Things. But they're just different. Um, they're different types there's different cards and then there's some like wild cards that get introduced oh interesting um but there's the tokyo expansion the capital expansion and then there's like a kickstarter exclusive one and then there's like a um oh is this a guide about how this is a guide about tier levels hmm. uh, okay oh, yeah. um but then there's uh there's a paris expansion so yeah, and then there's obviously all the yeah. ships for the the other ships. If you have more players, um. Oh yeah, so the the publisher or the designers, Dark Flight Game, I guess designers and publishers, they have a couple games up on Kickstarter right now. So they're doing a um, someone in the chat just asked. They're doing 
uh, like a Tokyo series of games. And yeah. I think they have a Kickstarter up for the first three ish, and right. one of them is a grab bag from like ten different designers. So they have the same components, which are like little, I think plastic or three D printed, um, like vending machine bottles and crates. And then there's a bunch of different games that I guess involve. Um, yeah. Vending machine. I don't know. Did you? See, I, I see? checked that out a little bit. It looks interesting. It was like a um, dexterity one. Or... Yeah. Yeah. Hey, how you? <laughs> uh, and there's even like a little vending machine to hold them. But then there's another one which I think probably would be the most up our alley, but I know nothing about it, having just scrolled the Kickstarter page. It's called Tokyo Railway, and it's um, a train game where you're setting up, you're like building out the mm-hmm. rail, uh, the uh, metros of Tokyo. So, that one interests me. So that could yeah. be interesting. So, you know, when it when it makes its way around through Kickstarter and comes out, I think you yeah. check it out. Check it out. Um... Oh, yeah. So, Arsman says they've played two-player a lot. They just follow imports and bid zero, which makes sense. Yeah. Like, if you have a free import, you might as well. I think that would be a, a goal early on. If yeah, get a playing, import. Yeah. To so get a free import. Yeah. I think that's something we didn't we didn't really do in our two-player. We didn't, no. Um, ah, I almost... I was like, oh, little Steve's gotta go in. Steve doesn't go in the game. Um, can I have the rules companion? Oh, yeah. There you go. I think having a physical thing to use as a turn marker definitely it helped keep track of who's yeah. turn was. I know they suggested in the rules, and I know they have a card, but having a thing that's actually like on the table. Uh, Kabuki wants to know if you use that hat to slap Gilligan. Secret is he's actually Gilligan. He slaps himself. Yeah. yeah. The reason I the reason I've never seen Gilligan's Island is because I'm actually secretly Gilligan. You've never seen Gilligan's I've never Island? Seen Gilligan's We're gonna change. Oh man! So Steve and I we had this whole discussion about Hogan's Heroes the other day, and it turned out Steve had never seen it before, and oh. so I found a channel on YouTube that has every episode of Hogan's Heroes ever. It's 174 episodes. Wow. And they're all free on YouTube because it's so old that like yeah. no one cares. Um, well, so- I thought I thought I had seen. Hogan's Heroes? And I was like, oh, I saw Something's Heroes. It turns out I had seen Kelly's Heroes, which is a Clint Eastwood movie where a bunch of people... It's basically like an early version of Three Kings. Like a bunch of um, soldiers do like an off... Like they go AWOL to steal gold and whatever. It was very like Clint Eastwood in the trailer and then stuff blowing up and then wacky characters. Nothing like Hogan's Heroes. Yeah, so we've been watching Hogan's Heroes every night before bed this week. Um, and it's it's entirely crazy, and it's a hundred percent the reason why there's an entire generation of Americans that belittle World War II and the Germans. Like I'm I'm pretty confident because like it's just really bad in that regard. Yeah, yeah. Just but it's really also just it's it's pretty funny if you can watch it with that in mind. Yeah, yeah. And be cognizant. Um, but now I guess we'll have to watch some Gilligan's Island in yeah. the evenings as well. Wait, Tiff was joking that. She wants to watch all 174 episodes to see if there's any character development. But there was. There was, there was like a little bit. They like referenced something that happened in a previous episode two episodes later. And oh. I was like, I was just really impressed because like a lot of sitcom writing. But I guess this is an older sitcom. But even like I Love Lucy, they don't reference stuff from, from like previous. Mm. So, yeah, it was interesting. But um, the box... Oh, we'll hold all the cards safe. That's says, good to know. Thank murder. you, Mary. Okay, cool. That's good. Yeah, there's a lot. Of, there's still some wiggle room, even with all the Kickstarter stuff. Um. <laughs> I think if you were playing this a lot, yeah! you would definitely want you would definitely want to sleeve it because you're just going through those hundred cards or slightly more. Well, and all the tucking too. Yeah, yeah, and all the tucking. I think that would bricks corners. Do you, Paul? Paul just realized what my shirt was. Do, have you played Fez? Because I love Fez. So I played Fez, and I loved it a lot, and then the 11th Doctor did the Fez episode, and they made the shirt, and I was like, insta-buy, yeah. <laughs> immediately. <laughs> and by they, somebody on the internet who's like, you know that one thing you like, and that other thing you like, I'm making it into a shirt. Yep. Steve hasn't seen that episode yeah, of Doctor Who yet, so he doesn't understand why I love it so much. I haven't seen yeah, any but... Doctor Any at all? Or Hogan's Heroes. Oh. Yeah. Hogan's Heroes all right, John, is really got, funny, but it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> This turns into a Hogan's Hero stream. Yeah. Yeah. Um, cool. All right. Sweet. It's like we played that really fast. It's eight forty-eight. Yeah. We could do a bonus stream. A completely surprise bonus stream. What? Yes. Part two will never happen, which makes me sad. But that's okay. I went to replay 
like Fez the original, and I luckily didn't remember anything from the first time I played. So I was like, this is good enough. Like that. Hmm? Uh, Heavy hasn't seen any Doctor Who. So, yeah. There's a lot. It's campy. You have to really force yourself to get through the first couple of episodes. Yeah. I, like, I'm the per- type of person that like really likes the canon or something, and if I don't, if I miss the first part of it, then it's going to really yeah. bother me. And then Doctor Who has a horrible the, first yeah. Three it took it's, it took me a while. I think the second season, the first season was pretty rocky, but then they kind of got into it for the second season. Wasn't it two no. seasons with the first Doctor? We're currently or watching. Doctor. Yeah. We're currently watching the second season. Okay. Now. Well. The like second the, half of the first season. The second half of the first. Into. Oh no no no! You're right. Sorry. Yeah, it was it's the second seasons. season. Yeah, it was it was the second season. You got into the like the last two parter episode on the last first season. You got into it. Yeah. You start with the the remake, so the ninth Doctor, when you rewatch it. Um, but you're starting with the very 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 first season. No. No no no. We no. Started, started with, with, we the, started ninth with the ninth Doctor. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Um. Yeah, the new Doctor. Yeah, that's yeah. the new Doctor Who. The older Doctor Who is super campy. And if you can find good versions of them, it's interesting to watch. But it's, yeah, it's a little bit more relative to rel- rel- something to Relevant. today. That word. Let's do a bonus stream. So it's been great. We actually have, um, we actually have some old... It's a lot. We don't have old stuff. We actually we have some other us and titles, which we haven't streamed yet, which weren't in the stream pile, which we could stream. So there's Sakura Hunt and Perfect Hotel. Oh, Perfect Hotel is definitely. There's Tybor. Oh yeah. Oh, bye Mer. See oh wow. Mer. Thanks for tuning in. And- Mer got Twin Peaks on Blu-ray. Yeah, he'll be gone for a while. <laughs> Um. Doo, doo, doo. I mean, I, Iberian is probably too long. Hey, Paul. Uh, Iberian Rails. Iberian Rails is way too long. <laughs> but that says something about yeah, how if, Steve if, liked that. If John leaves halfway through, then we'll yeah. yeah. Is there like a automa for the third company? <laughs> <laughs> they they just do nothing. Yeah. Really. We could play Illumat too. A full game of Illumat would be a little odd. Yeah, I would be, I'd be down for that. That seems like the best. We could do Paper Tales. It's another sponsored stream. It's pretty quick, too. Mm-hmm. Let's do, let's do Paper Tales. Cool. All right, we're going to do Paper Tales. All right. So Paper Tales is um, <laughs> also from Black Rock Games. It's from uh, Ketchup Games is the publisher, and then Black Rock is the, like, French distributor. Um, the, yeah, the distributor. And Paper Tales is, uh, it's a card-driven game as well, so it really kind of fits. So, um, the reason it's called Paper Tales is not because it's a storytelling game, which is a horrible reason to name the game Paper Tales. Yeah. It's, which I thought initially. Yeah. You're like, sweet. It's like Dixit or something. But yeah. yeah. It's called Paper Tales because the art style is, um, the classic cut paper where they cut yeah, paper yeah, and layer yeah, yeah. it. And then... You are making your own kingdom and building your own kingdom, and so that then they were like, it's the tale of your kingdom. But there's no actual story or tale. So anyway, it's like Paper Chronicles. Yeah, sort of. Paper Kingdoms or paper something. Paper Kingdoms. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. Um, so we are going to do a bonus stream of Paper Tales. We're gonna do that. So the way that we do that is we're gonna stop this stream. We're just gonna stop it for just like five minutes or so, and then we'll start it up. And that way, they're like separate videos, makes life easier. And then we can also update all the title information for people that are uh, just coming in randomly. So that's what we're going to do. It's designed by Matsu Usuki. Um, but thank you for tuning in and watching our stream of Import Export, designed by Jordan Draper and published by Dark Flight Games. Thank you again to Dark Flight Games for sponsoring this stream mm-hmm. by um, providing us with the base uh, game with the base game of import export and then steve was like but i want the ships and so he bought <laughs> he bought the like pack that made it a the captain's edition so um thank you dark Flight, for sponsoring this stream um and making such a cool 
yeah. little box and card game. Uh, and thank you to the chat for helping, yes. uh, you know, Ira Smith, yeah, keep us and honest. Her. And yeah, our Smith was, and Mer, just cool. for helping us get some of those rules that are that we were missing. Yep. yep. Much appreciated. Yep, yep, yep. All right, cool. So we're going to shut down the stream and we'll start back up. If you're not watching live, um, thank you for watching this far. And if you are watching live, thank you for watching and hanging out. Um, for those that don't know, in the YouTube chat, we are moving our chat to Twitch just because Twitch does a lot of the other stuff better and we kind of like it. So we're just going to start moving stuff to Twitch. So if you have a Twitch account and you'd like to join the chat over in Twitch, that would be awesome. Um, we are close to getting an affiliate Twitch thing, which means that we can make custom Ichi and Xena emojis. Oh, oh my goodness. We're going to make an Abby emoji too because I miss her a lot, especially when we play games. Yeah. Um, but I'm not going to cry. <laughs> um... <laughs> and the Ichi and Xena emojis already exist. They do. We just have to get affiliate status on Twitch, and then we can add them in. It's yeah. super easy. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. And if you're watching on YouTube, make sure you like the video. Thank you, Edward, for reminding. Mm -hmm. Um, Cool. And if you're on Twitch, make sure you follow so you get notifications when we're here, because the notifications actually work on Twitch, whereas on YouTube, it's hit or miss. It's another reason we moved. I still remember when Twitch was Justin.tv. No. <laughs> that was weird. That was a long time ago. That was a very long time ago. All right, cool. Um, we'll be back in like five minutes with Paper Tales. Peace. Dun, dun.